Brainerd High School students are spreading holiday cheer by giving gifts that keep on giving to our soldiers overseas. Our Logan Gay has more on that in this week's Golden Apple. Our veterans matter. We gotta help them out any way we can. Ms. Hecks from Social Studies class at Brainerd High School has been leading the way in a school-wide service project called Operation Paperback, which sends books and DVDs to soldiers overseas. Pretty much everyone in school bringing as many books as they can to give to soldiers that are uh, overseas in, in the country that are in need of some some to brighten up their day during the Christmas time. The Operation Paperback Drive has become an annual tradition for Ms. Hextrom and her classes. This year they are expecting to send over 700 books to soldiers who need them most. A lot of soldiers don't really have any books to read and it kind of keeps them entertained and they're overseas so they don't really have anything so they can read and also some of them have um, got brain injuries so they can't read and so the books help them be like learn to read again. And the project reinforces the idea that you don't need to be a certain age to make a difference. It's a great way to get all of the classes together and just to get the whole school like involved in one project. And Ms. Hexham's class is requesting that if you do decide to donate, that you donate paperback books or DVDs. Paperback because those are cheaper to send. One student shared that his favorite part of the project is when soldiers reward their efforts with personal notes of gratitude. One guy that was at like a military hospital and he said he was just learning how to read again and this Operation Paperback was really helping him because, you know, we send him like a couple easier books to read and now he's learning to read again. Ms. Hagstrom and her class will continue to collect books and donations to send to soldiers until next week. In Brainerd for this week's Golden Apple, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.